Hi, my name is Tiffany Williams, and this is my informative speech for oral communications online class. I recently got a new dog. She's about a year old now, but she's Australian Shepherd, and I was curious on if she was actually Australian and where her breed came from, maybe the history of her breed. So I did a little bit of research, and turns out she is not technically from Australia. The, her breed was from British, technically, so it went from Britain to Australia and then here, and then we named them Australian Shepherds. But the Australian Shepherds that we know now are a little bit different than the ones that originally came here. Um, the dogs that we now call Australian Shepherds are actually a newer breed bred in America. They've had many names over history, and they, a lot of them can be traced back to a very specific breeder in American history. The <laughs> Australian Shepherds that we see now were not recognized until 1957, according to Anton Hout. Um, he wrote an article called Australian Shepherd History at www.australianshepherdlovers.com. He also said that um, there wasn't a written description for the Australian Shepherds that we have now until 1977. So that's pretty new. And the American Kennel Club waited until 1993 to make an official recognition of the Australian Shepherds that we have now. So they're very new breed of dog. The names that they've had over history are c quite different. So they were called the Spanish Shepherd, Pastor Dogs, Bobtail Dogs, Blue Healer, New Mexican Shepherds, and California Shepherds over, the over time. So when you research them, you might find all these other names that come up. And Jan Reason, Reason sorry, <laughs> wrote an article called Nine Things You Might Not Know About the Australian Shepherd. And he was also in the American Kennel Club. On, he wrote that article online. So it was pretty cool and very informative on that. Um, the dogs that we have in America now, um, a lot of them, I think it's the thousands of them, can be traced back to the Flint Ridge dogs. And Flint Ridge dogs were bred by a Dr. Hurd in 1964. They were a very influential breeder of Amer the... Um, American history and a lot of the Australian Shepherds that you see now are related to those dogs like you can trace them back to those dogs and you can find pictures of them and everything um, so Dennis Denise Flame wrote a article called Australian Shepherd history behind the behind the breed I almost said bread behind the breed in 2020 um, and that was from the American Kennel Club. The uh, many Australian Shepherds we actually named since we have completely bred them here in America, so they didn't derive from another country. And the according to Anton Hout in the American Australian Shepherd History online study that I read, article, um, the, no the mini Australian was renamed the North American Miniature Shepherd, and that was in 1998. So they're definitely a very new breed to the Americans, and they do not match their name at all. So I thought that was pretty cool. Um, maybe you do too. <laughs>